continues in the Mazda Play LPL. It's match number 11 between two teams that are vying for two points. Dambula Aura taking on Candy Falcons in another exciting context. Earlier at the toss, Candy Falcons uh, was the winner. They elected to bat first. And that's been the trend here in Palakeli in this edition of Lanka Premier League. A look at both sides. Quite a few changes across both teams. Three for the Falcons, five for Dambula Aura. Roshan Abasinghe, Amar Soil will take us through the details of these two teams. Yeah, both the sides run few changes. And Dambula, you can understand our desperation because they are still chasing that elusive win. They have failed to make an impact. And that's why they have brought in Nuran Ahmad once again into their lineup to uh, trance the batsman with his varieties. McCarran, the fast bowler. Yeah, for Candy, the reason why they have made few changes in their lineup. Put runs on the board. Yeah, it's very important and imperative that his Sanka stays for a longer period of time for his side in this innings. Dustin Sanaka. Play. Play. It's an important game for them. And that's wonderful use of the feet from Patum Nasanka. It's a good option. And the batsman took the right option, just moved. Little too straight. Thick outside edge. Flies past the wicket keeper and beats the deep third. That's nicely placed. Stay in the competition. Now that is a quality shot. In the air. Oh, it's wide of the man. It's short third man. And it's going to run away for another boundary. Sweep shot, God. The idea wasn't a bad one to try and get it fine. The execution is not the greatest. Probably a top edge, Shadrang Risilu and Patum Nisaka knows each other really well, play the domestic cricket together. Opening batsman of the Falcon Gods of 26 of 20, Candy, 48 for one. It's a lot of patience involved. Let him try things like this. This time he gets it, but it's a good shot. He's taken his chances and he's made it count, but that's all right. Oh, that is a beauty. That is a beauty. It's slightly over pitched. It's a nothing ball, really. Powerful six over long on. Yeah, back of the hand. But it's outside off some. And hence, look at those levers. He can free them. Oh, he's gone again. This one's got a lot more height, but still enough distance. Plus six is just changing the momentum after Batum Misanga was dismissed. Good hit position, watching it really closely. Middle of the bat and it goes. How was that? And over to Sikandar Raza and back to Chaturanga Di Silva. That's what uh, the onslaught from Andre Fletcher has forced Dasun Shah to do. On field umpire. Down the track again, under Fletcher. A straight over the umpire, and that's a massive six. This is that last six by Fletcher just opened up. Just a bit of space going over the mid off area. Just looking to go inside out. Talk about the lower arm of the left arm spinner. TV umpire to director. We have a player review for LBW. Voltaka is coming. Pitching outside leg. Pitching outside leg. Go back to on field umpire, please. Just outside the leg stump. Four of the first ball. All right. 
runs here. Just a single. Oh, in fact, they're coming back for two. That's poor cricket. But eventually turning out to be effective. Would you risk your wicket for one run? He's nowhere near the crease. Yes, I have a clear He's decision to the giant screen. Close to a meter. Is. Confirmation on the big screen. This is ludicrous. He's gone for 44, Fletcher. It was good while he lasted. 93 for two. Ball. Oh, the reverse. It's a no ball as well. No, no, no. That's run away behind point, and that's a boundary of the free hit. Yeah. Again, a little chip in there. Well wide to the fielder. Another boundary. Ball for Dambula. That's surprising. Ramesh Mendes, who's built a reputation for himself as a wicket taker. Now, what was that? Poor effort. Noor Ahmed's got a change of ends. He's been very, very good today. Three overs for 15. Oh, brilliant. Someone else who's been very, very good. The slower the conditions, the harder it gets. Now, Ashen Bandara earns you that respect. Now, Banukaraja Paksa will not get to it. Want to have a look at the boundary, but I think he did enough to haul it back in. Something that doesn't shine. Oh, so should be careful. If not, all the last over. Five fielders in the ring. Mix up the 50, coming to Mendes. Brilliant knock. He made sure that he uh, capitalized on opportunity he got. Ballard really well started quite slow, but then build up his confidence and a brilliant 50 under pressure. Oh, he's got that right in the gap. Slow ball, he's picked it up again. More runs, more runs, four of them. The confidence growing. Lovely, lovely. In the air, there's a fielder this time, but will he take it? Yes, he does. That's the right thing. Comes down to track. Remote Babushan sees him coming down, and that was a slow ball into the pitch. Actually, in my pitch report as well. Slow I do four in the length deliveries. Come to Mendes, a well made 58. 40 balls for Falcons. Candy loses a third at 161. Four. Tried to pick it up on the volley, but it goes through him. He's picked that up. That's what he does. He's powerful. Well, he's a pocket rocket at this stage of the innings. Can hit the boundaries at will. I saw them doing this about two, two and a half weeks ago in the Afghanistan Sri Lankan one day series as well. Good hit. Good hit. Six of them. Shot got to learn quick as possible. Ashen Bandara only looking to play those cross pattern shots. Pull those Yorkers, try to get him down the ground. He's not so comfortable doing that. But if he does this in his arc, he's going to murder you any day. Answering your question, DG, always two plans. One, one, one to fall back in case if the batsman changes his stance, then you've got to make sure you change. Four more. This will hurt because I thought that was well bowled. The last ball of the innings. Well executed. They'll get two. Or they'll try to get two. And they succeed. A complete batting performance by the Falcons. Well, Dambulora, if they want to get to that 194, they're going to have to dig real deep. On the other side, the chase. 148 has been the highest score that has been chased down. So Lassit Cruz Pule, young player, just 24 years of age. 8.35 the economy, 14 wickets. Simon Daniel gets off the mark with a quick run. Simon Daniel and Lassit Cruz Pule. A new partner for Simon Daniel here. Nicely driven. That's a very good looking shot of boundary. Why do we on? Blackweight. Punch down the ground, hitting it on the up. Runs it down to third man. Useful runs. They have to take chances. He did that. 
was able to hit the ball nicely into the gap. Slices it. And straight to the man. How does he do it? Ball's a half tracker. An informed batsman just guided it straight to the fielder. Bandara wasn't going to drop that one. Bandara, wonderful hand, great fielder. Siobhan Daniel goes for nine. It's 23 for one. Oh, this is this is the problem. This is what I always found. Straight to the captain. Hansaranga. That ball held in the pitch, and that's why. Batsman wasn't in control. Karuna Ratne, 13. Was his individual score? Who's for it? And it's 24 for two. Not massive crowds by any means. Oh, where has it come from? Where has it come from? It's brilliantly taken down the leg side by Fletcher. Carlos Brathwaite. And look at the celebration. That was an outstanding catch. They're enjoying their cricket, but that's for sure how many times we have seen in this LPL the short ball working for Carlos Brethwaite. That was a fantastic catch. It's a big wicket as well. The end of Jordan Cox. He goes for one, 25 for three. Over the top. Rajapaksa gone all the way for six. Sent it soaring over cover. This Rajapaksha we all know. What a shot that was. Just opening the face of the pad at the last moment to be able to hit the ball aerial and out of the park. He's strong there. And it's because when he hits the ball... Oh, that looks straight, but Carlos Brathwaite asks the question. Gregory Brathwaite says, that's good enough for me. Ramesh Mendis. He's asked for the review. The decision will stay with the on-field umpire. Ramesh Mendis, the fourth double of batsman to be dismissed. He's gone for four, 42 for four. Make that 11. Make that 11 for Carlos Brathwaite in the power play. Andre Frecha, well, to batters and away from batters. That's a perfect length. Drawing the batter forward. That's on Sharnika. And finding the outside edge. Out of the 11 wickets taken now. It's 42 for five. hit it up in the air Ashen Bandara he doesn't drop many Sikandar Raza will he try to hit it to the skies and he hit it well 5, 0, 8 and now 1 he's a better player than what he's shown in this edition of LPL short delivery should have been dispatch for 6 miscued Raza goes for one. 45 for six. Nisanka. Oh, Needed a direct hit if he wanted a run out. But we're going to be asking the question from upstairs. Patum Nisanka lifted his head and hence the ball. Yep. Flipped upwards. 50s on the board. Game deep squalic. No, he's in the gap. Awkward length and the seeming option. Chaturanga Risula taking the aerial route. And the brother Vanindu Hasaranga of Chaturanga. Valiant attempt. You see that? Finds the fielder. Almost. That was a good effort for a long period, I thought. Oh, that's gone high. Should be taken. Should be taken. Yes. 
It's uh, Chavi Duvijay Singh's first wicket. It's taken by Minot Banuka. The bowler aura have become less urgent. Is he another evidence? They have struggled in every department. Anuka Raja Baksha is walking back. He scored 18 from 22 deliveries. It's 74 for 7. Oh, lovely. Four runs. Oh, that's short. It's up in the air. Is a man at backward point who takes the catch comfortably. It's Fabian Allen. He was in the mid 120s, rushed in a little bit. He was looking to slash it eventually. Top edging. Well, it's 82 for eight. And I'm afraid Tabulora just sinking even further. Tabula innings subsiding limply. Now that was offline. Swept away for four runs. Another one. He has a knack for taking wickets. That's his third wicket. And they're imploding in quick time here, Dabula Mora. Is not on your side. Even ball middle goes straight to the fielder. It literally had to be 50 centimeters either side, and he probably got himself a bound. Pramod Madhushan goes for five. Dumbula now nine down for 94. Oh, that is nicely worked away. It's the last ball of the last over. First ball he faced from him, would you sing up? He was clueless. This time just goes with a little bit of shape into the right hander. It's cleared that boundary easily. That's a clean strike. Clean enough to go for six. Right from the middle of the bat. It's very nice. I understand the air there. He's trying to entice him to play the shot, but the length was wrong. It's too full. And that's better. Inside edge. It's going to run away for four, I think. Oh, it is a valiant effort, but he won't be able to stop it from going into the advertising triangles. Confidence appeal, confidence appeal, and he gets uh, the umpire's support. Finger goes up and review taken. There is that confirmation. So the final win. Thank you goals. very much, uh, Mr. Heyman. Win once more for the Candy Falcons. They get back to winning ways. 77 runs, convincing. Four victories out of their five matches, and they get back on track. So this is a look at uh, what Dambula Aura produced with the bats. Top score of 25 from Chaturanga de Silva. 18 from Banaka Rajapaksa. No one really taking responsibility to lead the run chase. Wicket stumbling in quick time. Five wickets fell in the power play phase of the innings, and then that slide continued. They're bowling. Carlos Brathwaite again starring in the power play phase. He's been a crucial part of the success for the Candy Falcons with the ball. Three for 25. Ball consistent lengths got the ball to seem in and away from the batters got support in the field as well really like what i saw from which singer three for 25 the 22 year old is a maturing all-rounder can bat that's a first class average of over 50 and he's been successful with the ball as well two wickets to karuna ratna and two as well for fabian allen the left arm spinner Match 11, done and dusted. Falcons, they win by 77 runs. They've been superb with the bat and then with the ball. How does this win affect the points table? Well, they move to eight points and then replace Jaffna Kings by virtue of a superior net run rate. Nambula Aura still without points at the bottom in fifth position after four matches. Yeah!